this game underway. This best of three series in RFPC's second game day of this wonderful season six regular season. Actually, Mod is not playing for Valiant tonight, so maybe it's my key player. Nor is Zayo. So, off the kickoff here, just functional tree branch. We'll take this across midfield, a pass over to Kuroko. Kuroko puts this one. This will come straight down off the backboard. An early chance for Valiant, but nothing comes of it. Earl settling under it. Earl, I believe, plays for their minor team meme squad. I think he's a sub tonight. It's Nathan will settle under this one. Look for a dribble to set up a play. He gets a pass in the center. Maybe he'll take it himself. He will. He'll get a shot, and he will score that. Just 437 left in game one. Wildcats super now off to a very early lead. 1-0 off a nice dribbling play from Nathan. Split the defenders there. So as this second kickoff gets underway, it's a tree branch and a board. Board gets the best of it. It'll roll up the defensive side wall of Valiant, but it'll be swiped across. This ball will roll in off the corner. Nathan in pursuit. Nathan with the shot chance of it. Nice clear by Kuroko. This one, a pinch play coming right on the center. Earl, right it wrong. Tree Branch does all he can to just doink that one into the corner and relieve the pressure for a little bit. Slice will look for a pinch here. Earl takes this one through midfield. Defender for Wildcats 2.0 is Boar. He pushes it. A long clear. Tree Branch tries to get a block and actually goes right down to Kuroko. Kuroko around one Wildcats 2.0 player. Nathan looks for a center, but nothing going. But we're looking for a center here. Didn't get the best of it though. And Kuroko will clear. And Nathan keeping this one in. Nathan looking for a double touch. He gets it for a pass, but no one there. Tree branch. So this one straight up off the ceiling. Actually doesn't hit the ceiling. About to straight down. Nathan there. Nathan in the center. He has Boar. Boar ran out of boost. Nathan maybe looking for his other teammate. Home slice. However, nothing going there either. Slice will whip. Leaving open a chance for Valiant. But no one was there. A little misplay from the two attacking players from Valley will lead to a very good chance for Nathan as he picks up that side 100 boost. He gets a nice entering pass. Slice is there, but Slice just misreads it a little bit and doesn't score there. Kuroko will hit this one into the corner. Kuroko, a nice booming clear. This could set something up. And Slice, a nice block. Earl under it. Earl hits it straight to graphic board. Last man back for Valley. Tree Branch will take this one to the right. Maybe look for a second touch. Doesn't get it. Nathan hits it straight to Kuroko. Kuroko opts for the shot. Gets blocked. Earl looking for a center. This one will bounce off the corner. Home slice reads it well. Feathers that one in the corner. Kuroko off the wall. Pressuring it. Kuroko, he's got a teammate in the center, but a nice clear by Slice. Reduce the pressure for the Wildcats 2.0. More credited with a save there. Home slice will step into it. Nice 50 50 from the Valiant defender as Tree Branch looks for a pass to Earl. Nathan. It's the best of that 50 50. He looks for another block, but Kuroko hits it right beside him. Kuroko looking for a center here. He gets in a little bit of a flick. And no one, no one there. Nothing going to slice. We'll clear that one away. With a halfway point here in game two. Wildcats still leading 1 0 after an early goal in this game. Nathan looks for a pass in the center. A little bit of a miscommunication there. Look for Valiant. Isn't. Both of them hesitated to go for it. Here's a shot from Kuroko, but Nathan with the save. Nathan around one. Here's a very good chance for the Wildcats 2.0. A shot from Graphic Boy is saved by Tree Branch, though. Nice play by Tree Branch to get back and save that one. Earl leaves that one for Tree Branch. Tree Branch hits that one off the wall in midfield. Nathan puts that one close to the Valiant net. Not the greatest clear from Tree Branch. Will lead us, leave that one for Boar, but Boar doesn't have the best shot on that, and he hits it wide. Tree Branch taking this one off the wall. Looks like he's out of boost. This one will go to the left side of the Valiant out of the half. As a shot from Kuroko, it is on net, but Slice with a nice save. Nathan whips on the clear. Here's a chance for Tree Branch. Tree Branch. Doesn't get a lot of power on that one, though. Slice will settle right under. A little double touch pass from Tree Branch up. And he's got Kuroko, but Kuroko can't fit it in the angle. Now, the Valiant defender scrambling to get back as Slice goes up for this one. Slice puts it on net, and he scores to make this one 2-0 with 58 seconds left in game one. A nice counterattack there from the Wildcats 2.0.
Finn and Kuroko, a double commit off kickoff here from Valley. Tree Branch misplays that one. Nathan settling under it. Calvary gets demoed by Tree Branch. Pinch play clears this one away. It'll bounce one hop, and Nathan will clear it back into the Valiant zone. Tree Branch, this one to Kuroko. Kuroko looking for a pass. Maybe he doesn't get the greatest touch on it. Home slice hits this one right to the side. It'll roll up the wall and off the ceiling. And Earl reading it well. Earl looking for a center, but Nathan will clear into the corner. 30 seconds enough now. Valiant trying to get desperate here. They get a shot to slice with the save. Kuroko rolls this one around the corner. Not the greatest center. His board will settle under this one. Hit it one hop off the wall. A nice keep in by Tree Branch. Slice trying to get this one out now. And he wins a 50 50 doing just that. Nathan misjudges that one as he did not have a boost, but it looks like the Wildcats 2.0 will take this game one, and indeed they will as soon as this ball hits the ground. And here it is, Wildcats 2.0 win game one, two to zero. Very nice play there, just uh, nothing going for Valiant on the offensive side of things. Final shots for that game, a really low shot total. For both teams, uh, three or four to three in favor of Valiant. So the Wildcats Super had two goals on three shots. It's a very defensive game between those two teams. There weren't a lot of passing plays or anything of the sort. Um, pack ticker. I don't know. That's what someone said. That's what rookie mistake said. So as we get into the second game here, we'll see if Valiant can try to. Get the chemistry going and make the both make the best of their chances. So game two now underway. Kuroko wins the faceoff. Kuroko getting that side 100. Kuroko maybe looking put this one center and it's still center. Valiant threatening here, but Tree Branch just doesn't get the greatest shot and it's cleared away. Nathan. Looking for a pass to a teammate, however, Kuroka intercepts and Home Slice just able to get a piece of it and save it. Tree Branch off the corner wall, looking for a second touch, doesn't get it. Kuroko bends this one off the corner wall, still not the greatest center. It seems like they're, they're trying to go around the back walls too much. Maybe they should try some infield passes. Kuroko has this one right at Nathan. This will take a big bounce around the corner. And Tree Branch is there to clear it away. Keeping it back in his graphic board. And this play from Kuroko leads to a shot, but Tree Branch able to get a save on that one. A minute into this game here, Earl off the side wall doesn't get it. Kuroko, it's a block to buy Boar. Just not the greatest touches from Valiant here. Boar hits this one to the center, looking for a pass, and he does get it to slice. Slice hits it into the left side zone. Of Valley, but nothing going. And here it is at midfield. Board taking across midfield for the Wildcats 2.0. Here's a chance. This one on net and an own goal from the tree branch as he misjudged that one. The Wildcats 2.0 off to a 1 0 lead with 3.39 left in game two. Just some history for these teams. Uh, they're both 2 0, as I said. Um, when the first game day, the Wildcats 2.0 beat H2 over Paradox for their first two, first two wins. And Valiant beat O2 and H2O for theirs. However, one of these teams will have a loss after this game. And at this point, if Wildcats Superno indeed do keep playing like they're playing, it will be Valiant with a loss. Kuroko setting something up for Valiant here. Kuroko gets the center, Boar with the clear. Slice will step in to put this one off the wall. Boar there, Boar will hit it into the Valiant side of the field. A mistouch here from the Valiant defender leads to a shot by Nathan, and Nathan just forked that one, didn't get any power on it. Here's True Wrench going the other way, gets a center, but right to Slice, Slice plays off the bounce and gets a clear. Earl puts some off the side wall over the tree bench, but it's right to Nathan, Nathan looking for a shot. Here's a chance for a more pass, but nothing going. 245 left in game two. Here's a chance for Valiant. This one going towards net and in. Kuroko will push that one in to tie this game at one just before the halfway point of this game two. So Valiant right back in at their first shot of the game is a goal. And this game is even at one. Thank you for the bits, Squeal. 300 bits. Thank you, man. Another 300. That's 600 bits. Thank you, Squeal. 
donations go towards the press. Well, oh my god. A goal looking now at that right up the kickoff. The Wildcats 2.0 make this one 2-1 just three seconds later. I completely missed that one. So Wildcats 2.0 right off the kickoff for a goal 2-1 here. Not what you want to do if you're valuing they have the momentum going their way. Here's another chance for them, but it's saved by Kuroko. Kuroko. It's a beat to the ball by Home Slice. Branch clears this one down, a big loop and clear. Earl going up for it. Forty specimen in the clear. Here's another chance. A center here from Kuroko off a pinch. Another follow up center. A nice block from him, and Nathan under it, and Nathan will clear. It's at midfield. Kuroko keeps it in. So on one hops off the corner wall to the left side of the Valiant zone. And four pushes that one down back in. Or the Wildcats zone. It's back in the Valiant zone now. Here's a shot from the Wildcats too, but I know Kuroko with a nice save. Home slice looking for the center. Nathan does not boost, but he gets a nice touch on it. True Branch will clear a double commit here. All of the players from Valiant on the right side here. The misplay in the defensive rotation he doesn't hurt him there. Tree Branch looking to take this one out. He blocks. Home slice is clearing. Attempt Kuroko looking for a center, but again. Just rolling that one around the corner, which hasn't been working for them today. They need to try some infield passes. Nathan looking for a center. He gets it. Sliced there. Sliced for the shot. Maybe a follow up. A nice pass from Sliced, but Earl will be able to get a piece of it. This one will go into the corner for Valiant. Barkett still threatening. Kuroko hits this one. Home Slice misjudges it. Nathan keeps it in. Home Slice looking for a pass to the center. This one dropping straight down the tree branch with the clear. As both players for, the wild, or for Valiant left the net there, that could have been dangerous. Didn't hurt him there as a misplay there from the attacker of Valiant. And with one minute left, the Wildcats 2.0 are still up in this game. 2-1, they won the first game. 2-0. Nathan hits this one around the corner. Kuroko, this one could be on net. It's just wide, but a nice clear from Graphic. Releases the pressure as Boer, or Branch, excuse me, puts this one to the right of net. Boer gets a pinch. This one works as a pass over to Home Slice. Branch feathers that one into his corner. 30 seconds left now in this game. Valiant maybe trying to get aggressive. And here's a good chance for them. A play developing. Branch looking for a shot. It's off the post and in with 22 seconds left. Dysfunctional tree branch for Valiant. Ties to this game at 2. 2-2 two, two with 22 seconds left. Someone screenshot that. What a scoreboard. Nice save. Er, a nice shot there. Uh, thank you, Squeal, for another 600 bits. And yes, it does, son. There's a booming clear for the Wildcats 2.0 here. It'll be interesting to see if the teams try to play aggressive here. Maybe play for overtime. The Wildcats are playing aggressive. Nathan puts it just wide, though. Kuroko takes this one through midfield. He's got his functional tree branch to his left. Maybe a passing play at 10. Owen Kelsey the shot to follow up from his functional tree branch is a goal as time expires. Battling it with two goals in the last 22 seconds. Stay alive in this series to even the game at one. Tree Branch, his second goal of the game, wins this one for Valiant in dramatic fashion. Now, as we get ready for game three, things look very bleak for Valiant late in that game, too. They had nothing going, no offense, but two goals from Tree Branch himself, even this series at one. What a win indeed. Is Tree Ranch the new Jazz? I don't know. <laughs> Yo, Aki, could you already help? <laughs> So as we go into game three here, we'll see if Valiant carries the momentum over from that last game. Wildcats 2.0, maybe a little down in the dumps right now from blowing that lead. We will see what happens here in the game three right now. On the opening kickoff, Kuroko will settle under this one. Kuroko puts this one towards that. Not hard, though. Nathan with a booming clear tree branch able to feather that one. And then the right side wall, though, Boer doesn't read it well. His functional tree branch will take this one off the wall. 
He has his teammate to the left, but he doesn't get the greatest touch. Looking for a block here, home slice whiffs. Nathan will put this one down, a chance for Wildcats as here's a pass to the center, but Boar, oh no, almost an own goal for Valiant. Kuroko, winning the 50-50 this one, it goes right to Earl. Earl will play it one hop, actually misjudged that one, he'll leave for Tree Branch. Nathan gets a piece of it, right to Earl. Earl doinks this one up, Boar reading a well, Boar. This one, this one will roll up the wall near midfield. Back in the Wildcats, there it is. Home slice carries it through midfield. He has Boar and Nathan. This one is hit away for now. Boar, right to Kuroko. Takes this one through midfield for Valiant. Kuroko puts this one to the side. Home slice smelling under it. No one pushing for Valiant. Wildcats 2.0 looking to set something up. And the tree branch, not the grid is clear. We'll leave for a shot for. Actually, credit to Nathan, I thought that was Boar. But a nice save by Kuroko keeps that one out. Earl, don't want to put that one in the center, man. A chance for Wildcats 2.0. Leads to nothing. This one will be cleared. No, it won't. Kuroko misjudged it. Here's a chance for the Wildcats, and that one will go in. Home slice with 3.34 left in game three. Scores first for the Wildcats 2.0. It's happened all three games in this series. They are up 1-0. Functional tree branch for Valiant, the hero of last game. Pursues that one after kickoff. Earl will set something up for Valiant. Earl looking for a double touch. Tree branch under it. Kuroko pushes this one off the side wall. Nathan hits this one back towards midfield. Kuroko booms that one down. This one will catch the corner. Nathan will get a piece of it to clear more over to the right. Home slice, reading it here, booms it off the corner. Right there is True Branch. True Branch looking for a clear. Nice 50 by Boar, keeps the pressure up for the Wildcats 2.0. The Wildcats 2.0 looking to get a good chance here. But Earl will carry this one away. Not the greatest flick, Slice can settle right under it, but here's a good chance for Valiant. It's stuffed away. This one will roll back into the corner. A nice doing sets up a good pass for the Wildcats here. Slice going up. Slice with a shot, and he scores again to make this one 2-0 at almost the halfway point of this game. His second goal of the game, 2-0 Wildcats, 2.0. So off the kickoff, this one will roll slowly into the Valiant zone. Here's a good chance for the Wildcats 2.0 again. This one could work as the pass tree branch will clear. This one going towards the left side of the Wildcats zone. It'll take a big healthy bounce off the corner. Tree branch looking for a center. He got it, but a nice clear by Slice. Nathan, a little back touch, and looking as to a teammate who can clear it better than he could at that time. Still fiddling around in the corner are the two teams. Slice. Looks to get it away with a nice 50-50 by Tree Branch. But Boar hits this one back into the Valiant zone. Here's a good chance for the Wildcats 2.0, but a shot is saved by Tree Branch. Tree Branch dribbling this one here. Looks for a flick. Kuroko will opt for the boost, which will allow Boar to win that 50-50 for the Wildcats 2.0. This one will bounce straight down. Off one hop, Tree Branch clears it, keeping it in. On the Wildcats 2.0, Kuroko back down. True Branch will hit this one into the corner here. Actually counts as a shy and a save by Nathan as Tree Branch will look to air dribble this one for a pass with nothing going. Tree Branch hits this one into the corner. Wildcats 2.0 converging on it. Slice reads it well off the ceiling here. Looking for a chance, looking to set something up, but nothing going. Tree Branch clears this one and I'll go right below the ceiling. And one minute mark of game three of the series, even at one. Tree Branch misplays that one. He'll settle under, he'll get demoed by Boar. Kuroko out of boost, it's that one right to Nathan. Nathan, here's a centering chance for the Wildcats 2.0, still threatening, and it is scored the hat trick for Home Slice. Three goals in this game, what a performance from him. 3-0 Wildcats 2.0. This one is looking all but over. 47 seconds left in this game. Kuro 
Rogo slowing under this one in the Valiant Zone. 30 seconds left in game three. Sloan will take a big bounce into the corner of Valiant. Here's a chance. Home slice with the center. Nathan with a back pass. The shot from Boar is just off the post. The follow up from Nathan is just wide. Also, the 10 minute mark or 10 second mark of this game now. Nathan clears this one into the corner looking for a shot. But as time expires, this one will be over. So, Valiant with the late game heroics in game two. Doesn't pay off in the end as the oh no no goal cool. from <laughs> the Wildcat 2.0 will give Valiant and the first goal of the game as time expires. But this one is over. The Wildcats 2.0 take the series two to one, improve to three and zero on the season, and Valiant gets their first loss of the season. They follow to two and one. So what a series from them. So our second game of the night will be in about. Eight minutes.